So guys, for the first step, make sure you have Rainbow Six Siege fully closed. And now for the second step, you wanna find Rainbow in your library. Imagine that this is Rainbow. Now you wanna right click on it, and then click on properties, and then click on installed files. And now you wanna click on browse. And now the Rainbow Six Siege game files are gonna come up. You want to find the rainbow.exe file. So it's gonna be saying something like Rainbow Six Siege with a picture of Rainbow Six Siege right here. And then it might be saying .exe for you. Now once you find that, you wanna right click on it, and then click on properties, and then click on the compatibility tab. And now you wanna select disable full screen optimizations and then click on okay. And now for the next step, you wanna right click on rainbow and then click on properties and then click on installed files and then click on verify integrity of game files. You wanna wait for this to load. And now as you're waiting for that to load, I'm gonna be leaving three links down below for Nvidia, AMD and Intel. You want to download the software that comes with your graphics card. For me, I have an Nvidia graphics card, so I've got the Nvidia app. And now once you're in our software, you wanna click on the driver tab and then click on check for updates. Make sure your graphics card drivers are fully up to date through the software itself. And then once your files have been validated and you completed the other steps, the problem should now be fixed. If the problem is still not fixed, then for the second method, you wanna right click on Rainbow and then click on Manage and then click on Uninstall. You then want to uninstall Rainbow. Then you just wanna reinstall it again. This should now fix your problem.